Hello, my fellow YouTubers. We're going to do a quick test. I'm actually doing several, but I need two hands. So it has a cup of water. And before we take the test, let's look and see what we have here. So we have this cup of water, which piece of tape on there is my house water. That's a test strip for the house water. Let's take a look at it. It should be high alkaline. That's that's just regular house water coming from an aquifer. So the third one down looks pretty up there, and that is the pH, and we're looking at about eight. Let's say that's an eight. So if 7.4 to 7.5, that's six, but say five, is 7.5 is minus an electric it's minus 50 millivolts i don't know how it exponentially goes up but jumping from 7.35 to 7.45 7.35 is minus 25 millivolts and seven it's seven point four five it jumps up or it goes down to minus 50 millivolts very important so this has a lot down bottom here is the, let's see, alkalinity, third one up, very blue, very high. So that's my house water. Guess I got a gold mine, a fountain of youth, St. Augustine. The second one came from Lowe's, or from Home Depot. pH. Got some orange in it, huh? About 7.2, in between 7.2, 7.4. Alkalinity, third one up, nothing, very little on the low side then the next one i have is these are my tesla capacitors the salt water capacitors and they're loaded with um, iodized salt and that one came out let me see alkalinity it's pretty much on the bright red so that's going to be about 8.0 and then like purple on the uh, third one up like green not much there so on the p on the alkalinity green like like 80. so on <clears throat> let me see on the one that I have, the water I have up here is right here, is the test strip for that. Now what the experiment is gonna be, uh, we got it in between, the wheel will be beaten, turn it on and off the um, flyback, coming from a, a bridge, or um, um, a voltage multiplier and what I figured out is that